A juvenile offender has allegedly smuggled a mobile phone inside the Cleveland Youth Detention Centre and posted photos on social media. While the phone went unnoticed at first, the Department of Justice says the teen was later caught and the matter is now being dealt with by police. These pictures obtained by Win News are selfies allegedly taken by a juvenile offender inside the Cleveland Youth Detention Centre and posted on social media for his mates to see. I was playing with several uh, youth workers today and uh, other staff that are associated with Cleveland Youth Centre and there's been so several major security breaches here. A youth justice spokesperson says a juvenile was taken to Cleveland on Saturday and a mobile phone was found on the teenager later that day that had not been found during the initial search. However, the date stamp shown on Facebook suggests these photos were posted around lunchtime yesterday. The offender also details how he got the phone inside, saying, I left it in the holding cell. When I got searched, they put me back in the holding cell, then I grabbed my phone. He also posted the mobile number, urging his mates on the outside to give him a call. Councillor Les Walker is a former prison worker with close connections to the detention centre. He says the breaches are too common. There has been several in recent times. There's been a bottle of coke, um, USB sticks, um, mobile phone, the list goes on and the state government's aware of it. When Win News contacted the Department of Justice this morning, it said this particular breach had been dealt with relatively quickly. Then later in the morning, a police scanner recording confirms officers were sent here to the detention centre to collect the mobile phone. It's actually located a mobile phone on uh, one of the persons in there. It's He's further stated that the informant was in possession of that phone, but he was released from the centre on the 14th of July. The department says the matter has been handed to police with plans to charge the teenager over the contraband. The spokesperson also confirmed that the teen was released on bail yesterday. Benjamin Stavala, Win News.